Hey, tell me <laughs> this. I just watched the uh the Lex Luger documentary. Ooh, Lex Luger. I saw that a while ago. Yeah, that. that was interesting. I think they revamped it some. Like A and E got some new stuff or on the bios. Thoughts on Lex Luger's whole story. It's pretty fascinating. Yeah, fascinating and tragic. And it, you know, the one thing is is that with him is that if you see him now, you would never imagine. I mean, I'm not talking about the physical part, but I'm but personally, you would never imagine those two were the same people. Right. You know, it's it's amazing the transformation that spiritually he went through. And obviously the stroke completely changed his life, but you know, he was he was on a bad, bad path, man. Yeah, I, a and, really and bad path. I think the beautiful thing is like his uh, acceptance of, you know, this new phase of life and like from being that guy to you know wheelchair bound and you yeah, know, I mean, not looking the same like he's embraced it you know it's 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 amazing you know you know we talked about draws last week passing away and you know you go from being this uh, a herculean like figure to it gets it, everything gets taken away from you your career your body and everything changes and then you <laughs> then you got to realize you know what there's more to it than that you know, there's more to it than running around and flexing my biceps. Mm, you know, well, you're gonna make me cry. Well, thanks. Keep going. Yeah, but keep going. But you know, it it's and I follow him on Twitter, and it, every day, if you if you would follow Lex, he has he puts up picks up puts a picture up of something and and says thank you God for another day, another day. Thank you Lord. Yeah, and he throws out a psalm. Yeah. Oh. I mean, it's really, you know, it's it's amazing that that's the same guy that was the total package running around, you know, back in the NWA and WCW and the Lex Express and the whole thing. That can also show you that sometimes just because you have fame and fortune, you're not necessarily happy or living the right life or doing the right things. I mean, I, I grew up watching Lex, too. He was one of the guys that I watched. I remember the elbow with the thing. You know, he's got the metal brakes. I remember the whole thing with him so-called slamming Yokozuna, but he didn't really get him all the way up. <laughs> um, <laughs> he did the halfway slam, oh. but no, no, yeah, it, it's 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 just show you it's it's crazy. Um, because as a kid, I saw him wrestling, and now as an adult, you see what he's going through. So it shows you that everyone's human. You know what I mean? No matter what type of business you're in, um, you don't know who has demons or what they're going through, man. And he's been through hell and back. And if you see his story, I didn't know there was an A and E show. I got to go watch that. But yeah. if you followed his story in general, and like and like Mark said, if you follow him on Twitter, I mean, it's amazing how. If you just go back to God, how people can just change completely. And I'm not trying to be a preacher or anything like that. But, Preach on. It's you know, Sunday, man. Everyone has to go their own separate way and find their own self. And he found himself. And you know what I mean? It's just, uh, it is a sad story, though. And uh, At the end of the day, you have to be honest. It's a sad story. But it's good to see him, you know, on the right path. Well, you look at like a huge inspiration right here in the studio is, um, and I know we got a break coming up, but mark showing up every day like the work he puts in <laughs> yeah. you know after the type 3 diabetes i know like it's hard <laughs> he still it's shows hard. up man and like <laughs> he's a testament man like life ain't easy man but you just got to keep going mark and i appreciate you hats off to you sir well